What's up guys, how you all doing? For today's video I'm going to put to the test saw bars. This is uh, another log or branch holder so that way it's easier to cut those skinny logs or branches so that way you're not cutting it on the ground and not hitting the dirt and not doling out your chainsaw. So let's see how it works and hopefully it's actually going to be very helpful. It's pretty heavy, look at that. And there's a bunch of instructions. Alright, let's see if it's actually going to fit my car. Looks like assembly required. I'll just gonna put this in for now so that I can just assemble all these pieces real quick. Seems very simple, just one bolt right here and one bolt right here. There you go. The blades down. They're pretty sharp, so be careful, so it can hold the wood. Now a couple of bolts, and one bolt right here, it comes with a little separator. So as you can see, that's actually very simple. I'll tighten it up a little bit later. And one bolt right here, with this little separator. And this piece goes like that. And then we're going to put a bolt to it with a screw. This is what it's going to look like. Now let's put it to the test. So I have a bunch of branches that I need to cut it up, but cutting them on the floor, like this one especially, it's annoying because I don't want to hit the chainsaw on the dirt and doll it up and ruin it. So this is why this gadget is supposed to help a lot. There you go. Now here's the plan, you grab your branch and stick it like this. You want to double check it's not going to come out and there you go. Our whole stick is elevated. This is what it's going to look like. Pretty cool, huh? And check this out, now we can take this one out and we cut everything up without problems. How cool is that? You can just put it right in the trunk right away. Okay, let's try to put a smaller stick, see how well this one will fit. Not bad. Start to put in a bigger log. Let's see if we can fit actual logs, not just twigs and sticks. Boom. Push it down so that way it sits very well. And look at that, it can hold really thick logs like this. This one says pretty thick for sure.
And there you go guys, as you can see, you can fit even this really thick logs like that. I wouldn't do these big logs for this as much because they're really heavy to lift anyway, so might as well cut them on the ground. But twigs like this, really long ones, so as long as they off the ground, it's a lot easier to cut off all these twigs. On the ground, you have a chance hitting the rock, hitting something and get a kickback. So I like this a lot. This tool not just makes it easier, also it's a lot safer to cut twigs like this. Love it. Well guys, that's pretty much it. Let me know in comments below what do you think. Don't forget to thumbs up this video and I'll see you next time.